Hi, it's Alaska Granny. I'm out at Granny Camp and I don't have electricity here. It's my Alaska off-grid cabin. One of the foods that I like to have in my bug out bag, my emergency kits, and for off-grid simple living are the ready meals. They're by Campbell's, Pace, and Prego and they come in a variety of flavors. Each pack is a single serve. You can microwave it for one minute and they're ready to eat. Tear them open, pour them in a bowl, and eat them. What if you're camping, staying in an off-grid cabin, or in an emergency situation and you don't have access to a microwave? Could you still heat and eat the ready meals? Well, I'm gonna try boiling them. So what I've done is on my camp stove, I've brought a half a pot of water to a boil. I'm gonna drop in the ready meal, let it heat for about five minutes. The package should be sturdy enough to withstand the hot water without melting or leaking. The ready meals have a cool touch spot on the sides that you can hold on to it and pull it open. It's been about five minutes, so I'm gonna take my package out of the boiling water. Now remember, it's hot, so I'm gonna use tongs to lift it out so I don't burn myself. You can see where there's a notch. It feels warm. This one is homestyle noodles and beef. So you could actually eat it right out of the pouch. It's not too hot, but I have a bowl in case it was. It's creamy and thick. On a very cold day, you'd probably want to have it in the boiling water for longer than five minutes. It's not piping hot like it would be out of your microwave, but it's certainly warm enough to eat. Mm -hmm. It's the first time I've tried the Homestyle Noodles and Beef. It's pretty tasty. It's thick and filling. This is certainly a packaged meal that I intend to bring more of when I come out to my off-grid cabin, put in my camping gear, and for my emergency survival bug out bag. The ready meals are great if you're going camping, off-grid living, in an emergency situation, or just easy meals to have on hand in your pantry. They're shelf stable, so they're easy to stockpile, but do pay attention to the expiration date. Learn more at alaskagranny.com. Please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel.